Well, hello everybody, and welcome back to Julie's Orchids. I just wanted to do a little follow-up today on the first plant I owned to go into inorganic pumice stone as a media. Um, so this is Fragmentpedium pierci. I'll put a link here to the repot video. Now, during that repotting video, um, I noticed that this plant um, was forming its first ever flower spike. And I decided, since the uh, original media that it was in had uh, creepy crawly bugs in it, that I was going to risk the flower spike to transition the plant and put it into pumice. Um, and I can say that this plant has been a, a real trooper. So as you can see, it, it did continue to mature on this flower spike and make a slightly deformed first flower. Um, but it's also advancing this flower spike on. And right back behind here, we have yet another bud. Um, so for a first time flowering for a plant that was ripped out of its happy bark medium while it's growing its flower spike and put into inorganic pumice, a totally new kind of medium, and to only have a little tiny bit of imperfection to the first flower, I think is a win-win. Okay, so we'll look at the flower um, and I will attempt to do a split screen here and put in a Google Images picture of this flower, and we can compare it. Um, but I really like the little twisties on the side here, and there's just the subtlest hint of color right down here at the bottom, which is really nice. Um, now looking at the slipper, you think straight on it looks pretty good, but if you notice right here, I'll turn it to the side and see if you can see it, it's a little caved in. Um, it didn't form its full on roundness like it did on that side. Um, but again, for a first time flower, after having been repotted into inorganic media while it was growing its flower spike, I, I don't think we can really complain about a little dimple right there. I'm unsure if I could zoom in any more to the uh, inside of the petal, but so far the, the hood hasn't fully extended. Um, Let's try to get this a bit better into view. So I really like the the veining on that there. And just the subtle markings. It looks like a little moustache right here um, inside of this flower are just absolutely stunning. But to me, if you zoom, zoom in right there on that, it looks like a little guy with the moustache and his arms are hanging down to his sides. <laughs> um, and like I said, not a bad go for a first time bloom. There you can see how that slipper has a bit of a pucker. Right there it didn't fall out as well as this side, but it's still a stunning flower. And there are still more flowers to come because we have a bud here and a flower spike here that is also producing a bud. And there you have it, the first flower of this plant, um, Phragmopedium pierci. A little deformed, still very pretty. I'm very happy. I will do some follow-ups on this. As you can see, we have several more flowers to come. Again, I can say I'm just all over tickled beyond belief with this one. And I thank you guys for watching. Um, if you like the video, please give me and Frag Piercy Eye a thumbs up. A subscribe would be nice. And everyone have a happy, safe day. Thanks.